Hi everyone, so this is going to be Roma's party prep. She had a mermaid party and it was so fun. I think it was pretty successful. So it's the first proper party that she's really had because she was only 18 months old when we went into lockdown. So she was very excited and I am just filling the party bags. So that's the first thing I did. So I didn't put much in them I didn't want them to be full with plastic rubbish so we did a little puzzle book we did little pencils we did a tattoo and some stickers and then I think I just put in like a sweet and they had their cake as well um, so yeah we had these mermaid ones and then we also had some space ones because I wanted them to be a little bit more unisex and then they could just choose it wasn't like girls and boys like girls could have the space ones if they wanted but yeah I am just filling up all of the party bags and then putting them into a box ready to take. And now, for some reason, I decided I wanted to make my own like pinata baton. I didn't brave the whole pinata, so I did buy the mermaid. But the baton, I found a video on YouTube and it looked really easy. So I've got this wooden pole that I'm covering with paper tape, like sticky side up. And then you use sheets of tissue paper, fold them over, and cut slits all the way down you'll see in a minute a little bit more what I'm talking about um, and kind of do layers of that and then you cut the loops open of the slits that you've made I don't know if this is making any sense hopefully you'll be able to see a bit better what I mean um, but that creates like a ruffle skirt around the wooden bat that you use anyway I think it turned out okay it was quite easy to make but I would just probably buy one next time but because I didn't make the cake I wanted to do something a bit DIY so yeah this worked fine and looked fine.
So this was the pinata that I bought and the baton with it. I think it looked okay and it worked really well. It was quite easy to make. And now we're just gonna fill the pinata with all the sweets as well. This is actually the morning of the party now so we are just cutting up lots of pepper sticks we also did cucumber and carrot with some hummus on like a little platter we did some cheese puffs lots of pizza that we did on different boards And then we had a different variety of sweet treats as well. So we had like party rings, Oreos, chocolate fingers and things like that. So I'm just putting those into these boxes because they were easier to transport to the venue. Now we are there setting up the venue. I tried to get a little bit of footage but it was crazy and we were behind schedule so people started arriving but I'm just putting the cupcake toppers on here which I think looked really good. I really love this little watercolour mermaid theme. It was so cute. We had this pin the tail on the mermaid as well which they played and yeah it was a really lovely party so thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time. Bye!